Hello YouTube and welcome to our next video with the Asus PhonePad. It's time to put the micro SIM card in it and set up the device. So let's open up the antenna cover here. Ah, trying to get my fingers. Ah, there we go. And there we got our micro SIM slot. Just push it in until you hear the click. There we go. I don't put in a micro SD card right now. I first want to check out how much internal memory is free. So now we got the on off switch on the left side. Push it. It's vibrating. We got our Asus logo. And for the first time ever we got an Intel Inside logo on a tablet. Not, not for, for my first time ever. It's my first device with an Intel Atom CPU in a mobile device, not in a netbook. And I'm really looking forward to testing uh, the power consumption and the performance of this Intel CPU. So, there we go, enter SIM card pin. And now select language, English, yes please, next step. Uh, keyboard, English, US, oh this is nice. Yeah. The numbers one, two, seven here that you can always see where you are right now. Next step. Oh, this step was Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi, or uh, uh, Wi-Fi and cellular, or only Wi-Fi. Next step. Connect with our network. There we go. Next step. Google Location Services. Okay. Uh, we can now add a Google, conto, uh, Google account if we want to, but let's skip this. And there we go, time and date are fine. And there we are here. We got one, ah, it's <laughs> scrolling through. So now one, two, three, four, five home screens. And let's check out Our settings about phone and we can see Android version 4.1.2 Jelly Bean uh, and some modifications that as Asus had have made memory 1. Point, no 11.72 gigabytes and 11.56 gigabytes are free here not bad not bad at all and then we get our several extra buttons here. We get our phone button to make calls. Of course, this is a great feature. This is the feature of the seven inch tablet. Uh, we got also a messenger button here. Uh, everything is like, you know, from your smartphone, uh, unless it's a seven inch tablet. Uh, look at the apps. S Asus have definitely installed a lot of additional apps here and I'm not quite sure if I like this one. Um, free only pure vanilla Android would be my choice of system. Uh, not quite sure what I will think about this but um, I'm really looking forward doing some calls running around with this thing attached to my head and um, try using this really as a smartphone. So uh, thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video and bye.